think, first of all, you really have to understand the business of higher education. It can be easy to think that I'm just an IT person, and as long as I understand system administration or academic technology, then that's all I really need to know. But you can be most effective when you really understand what exactly is happening at all levels of your college or university. What, do, what are the concerns of the admissions office, of the trustees, of the alumni, of the people in university hall? And once you can do that, you can be a more effective advocate for how IT can help your entire institution. Second, they really need to avail themselves of learning opportunities, you know, whether those are things from Educause or other conferences, um, whether those are just other you know, self-paced trainings that they do, but they really need to keep current with what's going on. I think third, what uh, somebody who aspires to leadership should do is talk to people who are in leadership positions and find out what the reality is like. So do sort of informational interviews with anyone who has a job that sounds remotely interesting to you so that you can find out sort of what, again, the realities are of that job and what it took for that person to get there so that you can help map your future and figure out what you aspire to be.